everyone has the the standard rectangle face cam, but you want to be different. You want to have the circle face cam. Well, stick around. I'll show you exactly how to do it. Okay, so I have a scene, and in the scene, I am going to create a add my video camera. So this can be a webcam, can be a, a DSLR, doesn't matter. So we're just going to call it a camera. We'll call it yeah, camera source. We add that to our scene. Uh, here we go. Hello, I'm back. Uh, I have to in mind though change the custom and change the resolutions to uh, HD. So there we go. Boom. Now we're really back. So now we just want the circle. And so I have a image. So I'm going to go into my filters, add a uh, image mask, and we'll just call this circle uh, mask. Okay, we're going to choose a file of a uh, circle, which you will have in a link down below. And we want to choose the alpha mask. And so boom, there we go. So now everything is removed except for what is that white circle. Now you can just use other shapes, anything that you want. Just make it white and uh, a transparent background. Boom, good to go. Okay, so now you, uh, I also gave you, well, you'll have anyway down below, a link to uh, the border if you would like to have the border. So let's go and add that. So we're gonna add a new media source. And we'll call this the uh, uh, circle border. Whoops. And we're going to make sure it's looped. And we're going to add the chasing circles. And boom, there we're done. Simple as that. Now, not everyone is going to want it red and green, and that's okay. So let me show you how to change that. We're going to go into our media source of our circle border, and we're going to go to uh, filters. And we're going to add a color correction. There it is. And inside the color correction, you can change different things about this. Let's say you want it to be a little more darker. You can change the gamma or brighter, depending on what you want. If you want to change the color, you can change the, uh, the hue. You can see it's changing the colors depending on uh, how what the, the value of the hue shift is. And so there's all different kinds of things you can do with this uh, to change it however you want. I, for this uh, demonstration, we're going to make it look like that. Red and green, but like very metal edgy. I don't know, it's not really metal edgy, but I don't know. Just, I like it look like that. So we're gonna go with it for this demonstration. Okay, so now we're gonna add a new scene. So let's say this is our game of play. And we need to add this scene to our other things. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to add our um, display. Now this is going to send you into the OBS infinite looping, but it is what it is. And next thing we're going to do is we're going to add a scene, our camera scene. I should rename that to camera. Let's just go and do that real quick. Let's rename a uh, camera. There we go. So now here we go. And so you can see we have our circles in here and you can just circle, uh, scale this however you would like and you're good to go. And that is how you do it. That is how you create your webcam into a circle. You can do like, so you can do a lot of different shapes. I will have the circle and the chasing uh, borders in a zip file. The link will be down below. If you have any questions or you have issues, feel free to join our Discord. That link is down below as well. And we have a channel called Streamer Tools and Streamer Help. All the tools and zip files and things like that will also be in there as well as in obstutorials.com. And if you have any questions or help, just please uh, send us a message in the uh, Streamer Help. Uh, until next time, happy streaming.